trombón. Tigger. Too much advice. TMA. TMA. It's said that men are from Mars and women are from Venus, and K-pop wants to help lessen the gap between the two worlds. Everything on Love Every Friday with the love professor who kills love for me every single week, <laughs> Christian in the studio. <laughs> Hello, I'm here to kill love, I guess. <laughs> yeah, okay, so we have had yeah. a special request from our listeners. Okay. To you, Chris. To me. You can kill love for me. For you, okay. But not these two. Uh, okay. Okay, you can't touch guess, popcorn yeah. and caramel. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> you cannot touch them. I respect their love. Their, yeah, their yeah. love is forever. I mean, so. how hard was to find that love? I mean, really he's, he's a dog. She's a bunny, rabbit. Yeah. She's a bunny. Like, it's hard. It's, it's hard. hard to find. So I'm going to break that one. No. I promise. I promise. Uh, you're, so, you're going to break no, it? No, I'm not no, going to break okay, that. I'm not no, no. So every time, I, every time I say something about about girl bunnies, uh -huh. then I'm going to uh, <laughs> his ears so he cannot hear what is happening. Okay. And he can live Okay. Happy. Oh, yeah. they can live happy yeah, lives. Yeah, exactly. So they shouldn't be listening to our conversations too mm -hmm. in depth. Exactly. Yeah. Mm. You should, we should put some earphones on here. Right, right, right. Some earplugs <laughs> for them segment. too, especially <laughs> for popcorn. Uh, you got, uh, you did your hair. I did. I mean, I changed the color a little bit. I don't know if you like it. Uh, it's a lot brighter. It's like chocolate. It's, uh, yeah, it's like chocolate, kind of a uh, whiny chocolate. I love wine. Maybe that's why. <laughs> <laughs> oh, he loves, what kind of wine? Uh, red wine. Yeah, Ooh. red wine. I just, I just, you love I red just wine. I love red wine. I okay. cannot live without red wine. If my mom is watching, I love apple juice. <laughs> and I didn't dye my hair. <laughs> Either way, yeah. Either way. <laughs> it's just me and me and myself. Uh, yeah. No, yeah. Did nothing. Did nothing. Nothing. Nothing He's happened. Had, this he had week. a very nice week. Yeah. That's it. D only drinking milk and. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> I love milk. Yeah. Okay, uh, <laughs> so uh, you are going to continue uh, to send in some Isaac exposed messages. Uh, exposed. I wasn't. Exposed. I wasn't even supposed to get the penalty <laughs> yeah, this week, not. but <laughs> I got two. We need a new whole series of yeah. penalties. Oh yeah, so let's tell our listeners to send in some penalty suggestions. Yeah, for today. right. Uh, in Spanish, right? Okay, chicos, chicas, eh, vamos a renovar todos los castigos, así que mándenlos en español o en inglés como quieran. Si pueden en inglés para que la producción los vea en los comentarios. Exactly. So don't forget to send those in the message so we can hopefully print them out by the update time update them yeah, yeah update them by yeah. the time we have to choose them later on yes yeah. okay so uh, we have a very very <laughs> very 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 interesting topic today we do have every week uh, I'm very curious as to what your perspective <laughs> of this is and it's funny because also as last time it's a problem you can have nowadays right you, right 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 you, this is a very modern right modern problem, problem. You, you didn't have this problem 20 years ago 30 years ago you didn't exactly yeah. exactly that's why it's interesting we're gonna learn again together right we are so today's topic is is apps just for couples? Oof. Are you for or against them? So the story today is going to take us into a situation of this. And mm -hmm. uh, yeah, so we're going to kind of take this uh, perspective. So Chris, are you ready to do some awesome acting? Let's do it. All right, let's do it. Oppa, yeah. you have three seconds to answer this question. Uh, okay. How many days have we been dating? Three, two, uh, one. Uh, 30, 30, three days. 33 days. Wrong. Oh, yeah. It's 40 days. Uh, uh. See, I told you to get that couple app. Okay, so here, give me your phone. Okay. So, see the DJ feature? Uh -huh. You can add the day we became official, and then you can see how many days we've been dating. I mean, oh. we can chat on here, we can share pictures, and we can even share memories. Okay, this is quite interesting there's a diary feature a uh, ledger journal uh, calendars wow all these we can share with each other right so if you add things to the journals or the diaries i automatically get the same updates oh wow what was is this a location feature what is this yeah you can share your location through gps so i can see where you are when you're on it 
uh, isn't that a little bit like invasion of privacy kind of thing? Well, you know? I mean, I'm not going to use it all the time, but I mean, what if you get hurt or I can't reach you? I mean, it's a good feature to have. I, I guess so. I mean, if you like it, I, I like it too. All right. So apps just for couples. Are you for or against them? Agree versus disagree. <laughs> Roll says you have three seconds to answer the question. Okay, dumper. <laughs> <laughs> you have to. You have. To, you have three seconds of life. That's what. That's what she's meaning. You have, you have the last three seconds of your life. The, because any question a girl asks, there's not a right answer for it. <laughs> you know what? In how. Ever much my entire body wants to disagree with that, I it's true. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so like you said, yeah. this is a very modern ordeal. Um, ordeal. There are apps out there these days that that are just for couples. Just for couples, yeah. Have you ever used one of them? I have. I did too. Yeah. How was your experience? I liked it. You liked it. I never used the GPS. <laughs> feature okay okay i never used that okay. um but the posting pictures so i think for me the reason why i liked it was because in korea we have a very popular chatting service yeah so everybody's on it right but with a significant other if there's just a couple app for mm -hmm. you two i'm not constantly hearing that messenger going off mm -hmm. it's just my significant other and myself yeah, so exactly. i can separate my personal life okay. with my work life or social okay, life okay it makes sense yeah. so to be very honest i only used to open up the i would only set alarms for the couple app and then right. work app i would keep oh that, that's a, that's an interesting one because i mean i i mean yeah if it's important like mm -hmm. my entire staff calls me right so like queen v will call me if there's something important she won't mm -hmm. just text me yeah yeah. Okay, so right. that for oh, me, that, okay, that like, makes sense. Yeah, yeah. For me, I'm more of like if there's something urgent, somebody will call I me call. instead of oh. like, Isaac, are you busy? Like that's normally right, not right, right, right. an important call. Exactly. You know what I mean? Yeah. So, that's an interesting way to use it, though. Yeah, and <sighs> I I think I kind of liked it. It was convenient. Um, I'm really bad with dates i was even talking with our assistant writer <laughs> like i forget my birthday so this is what happens uh in radio uh, -huh. uh i'm constantly thinking ahead so like i've right. been telling our listeners since hour one next week our insider is going to be this person next week mm -hmm. this is happening the week after that is mm -hmm. this is happening so i'm constantly one week ahead mm -hmm. so if i'm one week ahead i look at like and i'm just like okay next week's my birthday ah it's okay wow it's the end of may mm -hmm. but then like when the day comes i'm just mm -hmm. like oh Oh yeah, it's my mm -hmm. birthday. Like mm -hmm. I'm cuz I'm I'm thinking st a step ahead. Mm -hmm. So, I need apps oh, to okay. tell me how long I've been dating somebody. Oh, okay, okay, maybe Cause, yeah, maybe you need cuz yeah. I'm the guy in the relationship. <laughs> I remember zero. Like I mean, but there's a like the basic calendar app that you can make the, you know, like the memo of memo it. Memo of but it. the thing is is like I do that like on my phone. It doesn't save to the next year. So, Christian, if I saved mm. your birthday into my phone <laughs> this year, this year yeah. next year it's not going to save. Ma there's a feature now that you can oh, do you that. Can. Yeah. <laughs> you Never can save mind. it. Like, yeah, yeah, yeah. Anyway, Never I, mind. I, I used the application too. Okay. And uh, it, was, it, it was fun at first. Okay. Because, you know, it's like you... Both of the persons have their own world. Mm -hmm. You can share stuff. It's just like a social media for the both of mm -hmm. the both the persons. So I think that part is fun, but I think it gets a little bit too invasive in terms of like the GPS feature mm -hmm. and stuff like that. I don't like that. Right. I don't. I think that's that's way too much. Mm -hmm. Right. Uh, and I'm not saying because oh some people just want to hang around and not tell the other person where it's going. But it's, it's, it's just too much, you mm. know, like... <laughs> just to have the feature on I'm, there. I go to the supermarket and she will be like, oh, where are you going? You're not home now. <laughs> <laughs> you know, like, like... Why are you at yeah, home? Well, why are you at home? You told you me said, you were going to be yeah, at home. Where are you going? Yeah, you said you were at home watching TV. Why are you out? <laughs> right, right, right. So it's like uh, being checked all the time. I personally, I didn't like the experience mm. at, at the end. Mm. It was fun at first, but I didn't like the experience. But mm. nowadays, there's a lot of apps going on and they have a lot of interesting new features actually there's a few ones I would like to recommend you I mean for people who likes this kind of stuff uh, there's one called Today 
Mm -hmm. uh, which basically the most important features are that they can save the important dates. And I mean, there's people who like this stuff. Like when the important dates pops up, you can set a background picture and stuff like dates and memories, etc. And you both guys can uh, set the dates. So it's not only your account, but it's both of them accounts. So you can both like regulate and stuff like that. And there's another one is called B2 One. Which the main feature is like you have a private messenger, which most of the apps they have now. I yeah, think. they're yeah. pretty much private. And you have your own like uh, social media feed kind of stuff. So you can like have your romantic stuff like just in one mm. place. Then you have one that is called Date to Pop, which um, it's uh, for couples that like to travel. And I, I like this the most because you can select the place uh, to have uh, days together. Um, like where to go, like what to, to go, eat, themed. And also you get recommendations of mm -hmm. good hotels and plane tickets and stuff like that. Uh, couple oriented. Yeah, of so course, it's of not course, that bad. Course, it's not that bad. It's not that bad. I like mm. it, and uh, probably after the pandemic, maybe a lot of people can use this kind of stuff. I mean, I don't uh, personally think I'm gonna use it again. And so you disagree? Yeah, I disagree. I agree. Well, yeah. I'm glad we we are pretty uh, that for that. Now, a lot of our listeners are talking about dating apps. So right. dating apps and these apps for couples are different. Different, yeah. They're a completely different platform. Yeah. So the ones that I've used in the past, both of you have to sign on together. Right. So like if Chris and I were making a uh, an account mm -hmm. together, both him and I have to connect link our profiles correct, correct, and then correct. start the application correct. it can't so yeah, um, yeah unless yeah. you're going to be in like a cyber relationship with yourself <laughs> you can't do this with strangers yeah it's for a, already made couples yeah it's for couples who are already dating and dating apps is for seeking seeking for couples would yeah. have you ever been a part of dating no, apps no, I, it's, it's, not it's not my, my thing yeah it's not I, my style i either. like the the not the offline stuff <laughs> just go there and try right, the offline right, 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 stuff right, i think right, it's right, more right, fun right, and everything right, right. and by the way when you use this uh uh couple apps you just make sure when you break up, <laughs> you eliminate all the data <laughs> for. Oh yeah, just because, delete. Yeah. Because if you terminate your existing profile, everything. Don't just delete the app, but terminate. Oh no, the you have profile. to terminate because <laughs> I think Chris made it a, a, a problem with this because if you try to re-sign in and you have an existing account, oh. everything is gonna be there. Yeah, everything. <laughs> everything oh, so it is gonna to be you. there. Not to me, but a really close friend. It happened to him. He resigned. So he he broke up with his girlfriend. Yeah, a few he years thought, later. Yeah, he thought that if I just erase yeah, the app, it's he, gonna he, for, yeah, just disappear right. everything. He has a username and a, and a password, right? So there's this new girlfriend. It's like, oh, shall Let's we sign up together? And he was like, yeah, yeah, let me sign in. And he was like, whoa, whoa, whoa let me <laughs> check this stuff. Yeah, because everything was there. All the data was there. So you have to terminate the account. Yeah, terminate your account. Or or make a new whole profile name yeah. profile name like yeah. yeah i love you and that person's name i don't know whatever yeah. but just be careful with that because yeah it happened exactly. to someone all right so emilita is asking i mean what's the meaning of these couple apps so in korea currently apps are created it's a messenger app just mm -hmm. for you and your significant other exactly. i've seen a lot of friends use this mm. like just really close bffs like friends yeah I mean, like I mean, girls you know yeah. how they, they went their own little right, world right, right, right. so they also kind of use these dating apps that is cool. or not dating apps the couple apps to use them so it's just a world of your own so it's like any messenger system you have you can download and buy emoticons mm -hmm. you can uh send pictures you can upload pictures you right. have diaries you have d-day type of settings it's just all the things that a couple could love together into one application exactly. and it's just for you two mm -hmm. yeah yeah and and don't use it wrong don't use it to like you know like do bad stuff like cheeto stuff like that because you know like if you there was one case of one friend of mine that he had a girlfriend and he sent a screenshot of his phone to the girlfriend for some reason. And in the logos, there was the couple app, app. The couple app, the couple app, but he was not using it with his girlfriend. 
<laughs> and then things got really bad, you know, because like, oh. Christian, what kind of friends are you having? <laughs> Don't be friends with people like that. I mean, I mean, I mean a lot of stories I've heard. Oh, so that's it's crazy, so crazy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You had to gotta be careful with all this stuff. Okay, so Karina saying, "Oh, I think I heard about these apps on Christian's podcast." So yeah, I guess exactly. apparently you've caught yeah, up. Yeah, you yeah, talked yeah. about these. We talk about that, and I also the friend that had to had the account problem, he came and talked about that live. Yeah. Okay, so if you want to go back and check out those videos, <laughs> yeah, yeah, <laughs> that's yeah. the friend he's talking about. Yeah, that's the friend. <laughs> yeah. So I mean, I'm ag I agree with them because yeah. I tend to be the guy in the relationship most okay. of the time, so I don't remember things very well. Mm -hmm. um, I'm bad with anniversaries. Oh, okay. um, I yeah. Yeah, you don't. You don't. I'm, basically... I'm really bad yeah. with that kind of stuff, and yeah, so yeah. I kind of need these applications, not yeah. necessarily the GPS systems yeah. to check up on them, yeah. but just you know that one area where it's mm -hmm. just the two of us. We can text each other, and it's fine. You're private on word. Right, but I feel that a lot of people who disagree is just like it's like like you said, it's more of like an wow. invasion of privacy, and it's just mm -hmm. too much. Maybe too much. Yeah. Maybe too much. A little too much. Yeah. All right, so fam, you're gonna be sending in these. Uh, choices as we continue on with the second uh, the second hour of the show mm -hmm. uh i'm stuttering because we're getting closer and closer to my <laughs> isaac exposed plus my uh isaac exposed other penalty for today so yeah <laughs> stay tuned for that uh but in the meantime what we're gonna do is take a quick song break and then we've got part two of our tma coming up next it's a cnb in love we have all of our fam present as the second hour of K-Poppin' continues. All of our loyal K-Poppin' fam and also other Adirang Radio listeners are dropping by today because it's Christian Day. He's our love professor wow. who loves to kill love for us each week. <laughs> Today's topic is quite... Uh, a very interesting topic yeah. because couple apps are really popular in Korea. Yeah, I they see are. that they are they also are. spreading over to Asia as well. Probably, yeah. Um, mm -hmm. And so it's pretty much just a application. It's a, a messenger app that you and your significant other can use. So two people in a relationship can use it. You have to sync each other's... Uh, Account. accounts mm -hmm. and then you can share all kind of things it's just exactly. like a yeah. it's just like an average messenger but just the two of you <laughs> just pretty much the it's two just exclusive you. you for you just the two <laughs> of us all right Chris, there's been a lot of messages coming in in spanish yeah uh are any of them penalty suggestions or are they just hellos or are they uh ideals on today's topic hmm. Okay, uh, there's uh, someone saying from Mexico, don't meet people in dating apps. Yeah, no, we, <laughs> me and Chris are never really big on dating oh apps. Oh, my God. And um, someone that is um, that is loving the show. Oh. Yeah, loving the show. Uh, how long Popcorn and Caramel have been dating? Two weeks. Two weeks. Oh, Oh my man! <laughs> the highlight of any relationship. Two weeks, yeah. Two weeks is just fun and fun, and more fun. Yeah, if you're finding two, two weeks. weeks into relationship, there's something wow. wrong there. Wow. Um, I, I, there's someone saying, I think I'm understanding a little bit more with the time. I think my English is getting better. Ooh, yeah. yay! I'm great. glad. Great, great, great. There's a there's such a good like you know like. A, English practice for all of us, I think. English plus Spanish yeah, plus, plus Spanish. Korean as we yeah. do get a chance to look at all the languages. Exactly. Now. Yeah. Perfect exactly. transition. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> so, so uh, if you could send in some more uh, penalty. penalty suggestions. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh, thank you, Chris. You're no, reading my mind today. I'm, I'm happy. Yeah. So continue <laughs> to send those in. We do need to kind of refill our mm -hmm. tin cup. So yeah, exactly. yeah, continue to send them in. Uh, also, if you have any more ETAC exposed, send them in too. It's exposed. I sent my picture <laughs> in, so I think that'll be going up. I, I wish they just put an explosion sound when I say, it's exposed. <laughs> yeah, I would love to hear that. The lie detector <laughs> test is coming up in just a few moments for me. So. <sighs> Yes. Hi. Yes. Uh, we're going to learn Korean, English, and Spanish for today. And we're going right. to be looking at the drama, mm -hmm. www, search www. Exactly. This was a hot drama. Mm -hmm. uh, I think it was pretty underrated at the time. You think so? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Because... There's just a lot of other things going on at the time of this drama. So um, the scene we're going to be looking at is uh, something that is very Korean. I think that 
Um, it could be equivalent with like a guy's night out, but it's very different mm, than a guy's okay, night yeah. out because I know that in the States and in like Mexico, like guys night outs or girls night out is more of a uh, common mm, thing that people do. Okay, yeah. But in Korea, yeah. 동창회 Mm, yeah, yeah. Or Tong Tang Moim. So That's alumni so dinners or like these drinking uh-huh. meetups are very popular. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, so to kind of give you a little bit of backdrop of what these uh, alumni dinner slash drinking fests are, yeah. uh, Korea is obviously a very small country. Mm-hmm. And we're kind of all jam packed in mm-hmm. here. And, you know, you are able physically to be in contact with friends that you went to school with in elementary school Mm -hmm. in junior high and in high school and it seems to be quite popular as soon as people start getting married Mm -hmm. they start to kind of look back or reminisce Mm -hmm. on kind of like you know those 10 year and because in the states like we have 10 year anniversaries after you graduate high school graduation um but in korea it's not just based on high school reunions Mm -hmm. we're talking about like junior high Mm -hmm. elementary school like people you went to (laughs) kindergarten with um i don't know why this sense of like communion or yeah, unity it, is so really strong, strong but Korea. it's very strong it's just like oh you went to Arirang school yeah me too <laughs> it's just like it's one of those yeah. and so the reason why these are always the problem in a mm-hmm. lot of relationships yeah. is because there's going to be men yeah. and women there mm-hmm. this is not just a guy's night out where mm-hmm. you guys are going mm-hmm. to drink beer play pool, do whatever guys do on guys' nights out, there's going to be girls there that Uh you went to school with. Mm -hmm. So most times, Mm -hmm. nine times out of ten, that person's first love is Mm -hmm. going to be there too. Mm -hmm. Because everybody's had a crush on somebody when they were in elementary, junior (laughs) high, and high school. <laughs> nice, that's nice. Nice explanation. So that is why. I, I actually had you no know, like the full idea of what is it. Right. Well, because <laughs> if not, you won't get the scene. Exactly. You yeah. won't get our story for today. Because mm-hmm. exactly. it is important. It's very background. important. The reason why the context, the context is mm-hmm. like this is because of that. Mm-hmm. So that is what Tung Tang is or Muim is. Uh, when we talk about these alumni dinners, it's because like from junior high, high school, or elementary school. Men and women are going to be in a place drinking and reminiscing on, oh, the good old days. Yeah. All right. So are you ready to act this out? Yeah. All right. Let's do let's it. Do it. <sighs> <sighs> 왜 질투를 나한테 안 하고 다른 사람한테? Why aren't you getting jealous because of but of someone else? 지금 나한테 따지는 거야? Don't cross me. 아니 화내는 거야. 사귀는 건 난데 왜 엄한데 가서 질투를 해? 경우가 이상하잖아. 질투 보여줘. No, I'm getting mad. We aren't even dating. Why are you getting jealous in other places? It's just weird. Show me jealously. Wait, what? You want me to act here? Oh, na, don't chame kangon, haji, mod matangazana, kumamuroe bachiltu. Yes, you still aren't happy I went to that alumni dinner. Show me that feeling jealously. How do you show Chiltu? How do you show jealousy? Uh, like, <laughs> there's no like it has to be like natural thing, right? You can just show like ask them to give you like Oman one or something, like to give you money. It's not something like you can just take out and show them you have. <laughs> what a weird request. Are you a jealous person? I do. Yeah, I am. I am. I am a, I'm a jealous person, but I I wait wait for the timing to show it. I'm just gonna, <laughs> <laughs> I'm not gonna be like, hey, do you want some jealousy now, or maybe some a little bit later? I don't know. Right. Roll is like, wait, why does this sound so weird in English? It does. This yeah, entire though. conversation just does not make sense yeah. because it's a very Korean thing. It's cultural stuff involved. Right. Jealousy is not. 
something we t- kind of talk about this way in English. Right. Like, we don't say, show me how jealous you were last <laughs> night. But in Korean, it makes sense. Pull the ball, tutu. Right, you know, I want to like, wanna see you get upset over me. Give me interest. Inter- like, yeah. 관심토. It's, yeah. It kind of feels show like. Me show me the interest. Which is like, interest. Yeah. it's so, uh, in <laughs> English. Yeah. 관심 좀 줘. And then yeah. you're like, show me interest. Give like, me attention. Wait, what? Give me the attention right. I deserve. Chill to boy uh, That's probably exactly the, the same the, thing. The, the, yeah, the meaning. So today's is a big learning process because it's a very culturally different yeah, ideal. It is, it is. So uh, out of this very cultural different <laughs> ordeal, Chris, uh-huh. what are we going to be learning for today? Okay, I was thinking, I mean, there's a lot of interesting phrases here, but like saying chill to words or I don't think it's a useful phrase mm. you can actually use. So I'm going to show you Ani, <laughs> Because this also you can use it like uh, I'm getting mad, mm. right? This expression you can use it when you are you you want to actually say that you are really getting mad and people is not taking you seriously. Mm. I'm getting mad. Right, I'm right. real mad. I'm super mad. Even you can say that. Mm-hmm. So that's what we're gonna learn in, in English and in Korean and Spanish. So ani hanenun goya. The first ani, I just want to point this out because in, it's it's such a Korean thing. Ani. You make you put it there not in a negative way, but just to make some emphasis. Right, which is opposite from English because we would say yes, yes I'm getting mad. I'm getting mad. Well, but here though, it's like are you don't cross me. It's like no, I'm getting mad. Like I'm not crossing you. No, I'm getting mad, right. which also makes sense. But normally we would say yes. But even if you're not replying to the question before, you can put the ani on it. Like when when I'm ani. about to talk to you, ani <laughs> Oje, yeah, ani, oje. <laughs> like, you just put ani, you like just put as, no before yeah. saying anything, mm. and it just like drag people's attention. <laughs> yeah, like, <laughs> <"Ku>, <laughs> ani. <laughs> like, you have a few words, like, few right. keywords in Korean. Few words in Korean. If you want to look like you have been living in Korea for 20 years or something before talking, you just put ku or put ichana or put ani, mm. and then the people will be like, wow. So good at Korea. So good at Korea. So natural, right? So that's the first thing. So that person starts, Ani, Hanenun Goya. Hanenun Goya. So that's the present form of I'm getting mad. Mm-hmm. I am mad. Mm-hmm. And Haneda uh, is the verb of getting mad. Nun Goya is like the present form of it. Mm-hmm. And that's just it. It's talking in an informal way. And in English, it's no, I'm getting mad. Mm-hmm. In Spanish, it'll be no. 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 Uh-huh. And then you make a break. The, after the break, you put estoy enojada. Well, that's hard. If you're a girl, mm-hmm. estoy enojado. If you're a boy, enojado. Enojada. Enojada. Mm. Enojado. That means to get mad. It comes from the verb enojar, which means to get mad. Mm-hmm. And... Uh, that's how you will say it. No, it's but enojada. The the important thing here is the is the pause. No. No, exactly. You the longer the better? <laughs> probably because if if you say no estoy enojado, that'll that'll mean I am not mad. Oh because you're using the negative form, right? Mm. So you you really have to give the space and make them feel the period. <laughs> no. No. Estoy enojado. <laughs> Yeah. Oh, I think be. I just said mama. Yeah, yeah. I think I just said mama in you. No, Christian. Estoy enojada. <laughs> <laughs> My mom is here. And, yeah. Mama's listening. Yeah. Her soul is here. Of yeah, co- always. Yeah. With yeah. La Ancla in hand. <laughs> waiting. Ready, ready to throw all the way to South Korea. Oh, yeah. I'll throw all the way to South Korea. Because <laughs> all Mexican moms have the power to make La Ancla come fly. all the way here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah and exactly. boomerang back. Exactly. And <laughs> boomerang <laughs> back. After I get here, oh. it just goes back to Mexico. <laughs> and she, she she grabs like tour grab his, his <laughs> hammer. <like>, Suck. <laughs> La Ancla do. Chris, so Chris is doing my show. She always she gets hit in the back of the head, and then he goes back. And, and when he, she grabs it, like there's a light coming out. Like, pff, pff, like, yeah, exactly. Oh my god, that's so hilarious. Exactly. Um, yeah. So the the po- the pause is important. Oh, okay, so yeah. the pause is important because mm-hmm. if not, you're literally saying that I'm not mad. Exactly. Yeah. So uh, <clears throat> if you take the pause away. Mm-hmm. 
no estoy enojada. Uh, yeah, no estoy enojada is like if you were talking to me and you're like, are you mad? Are you mad? Like, no, 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 no estoy enojada. Mad. Right. No estoy enojada. That sounds very scary. Uh, yeah, that sounds way more scary. <laughs> that like if she she tells you, she tells you, no, no estoy enojada. Oh, That'll be, ooh, you have to run away. I think that's universal. Yeah, it kind in, of is. In any, kind of is. no, I'm not mad. Yeah. But, should I be? Uh, oh. <laughs> Today, is there any reason I should be mad for? Uh, no, no, no. That, that's, uh, no, that's, no, 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 no. But you know, even if you say the ani, the Korean, like the negative form, that'll be more like, oh, 혹시 화났어? Ani? And you you stop, then it's like way worse then. Oh, yeah. Because like, that, that's get, like all that subtext is just going straight in there. The shorter it gets, the scarier it gets. Right. I yeah. think the English, Korean, and Spanish, the shorter, the scarier. Yeah, exactly. The shorter and the yeah. scarier. Okay, so, Chris, yeah. let's go back with today's lesson. Right. So, in Korean, mm-hmm. it is... 아니, 화내는 거야. In English, it is... No, I'm getting mad. Okay, and in Espanol, it is... No, estoy enojado, or no, estoy enojada. Okay. With the pause. With the pause. With the the pause. pause is important. It's important, it's crucial. Because if not, you really aren't mad. Exactly. Or are you? Oh, maybe not. <laughs> <laughs> so continue to send in those votes and Isaac exposed uh, and penalty suggestions. Yeah. Oh, there's exactly. so many things that our listeners have to do today. Pang Myung Soo is singing Fire with Kid on the track and more of Fire. TMA's coming up next. <laughs> there you go. It's set. It's set. So we were setting the lie detector <laughs> test. Um, <clears throat> so yeah, uh, I didn't have to do the penalty <clears throat> last week. Yeah, you didn't. But because of <laughs> Christian insisting that he was going to choose another one, I all of a sudden had to do not one, but two penalties. Two penalties. You already uh, uploaded the first one, right? Yeah, I already uploaded yeah. the first one. The picture has yeah, been yeah, sent. Yeah, you can check that on the um, social media social account. Media yeah, account. I think we posted it on our uh, home page as well. So now we can <laughs> get into the phone part because I have some questions from the people also. <clears throat> so we're going to start... With some easy things, okay. Do you, Isaac, love Arirang Radio with all your heart? Oh, yeah. Yes, I do. Love uh, Arirang say, Radio with love all your, of my your, your heart. Of course oh, let's I do. see. Maybe you did it for so long. Maybe you didn't feel good. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. Oh, my God. That's shocking. Oh, my God. <laughs> Um, <laughs> okay, you want to keep doing it? <laughs> um, <laughs> I think my palms are a little sweaty there. <laughs> okay, okay. <clears throat> okay, next question. Oh, okay, dear. next question. Yeah, next question. We already know that you don't love what you're ready <laughs> with. You are. Second, I don't think I'm going to come back next week, second, guys. <laughs> second question. Do you find Queen Bee's orders annoying? No. She no. doesn't give me orders. She doesn't give you orders. Okay. Let's no, she see. doesn't. Let's I can't say this is annoying because like, she doesn't give me orders. Okay. Well, I'm ever fine, Queen Bee. Anno- <laughs> <laughs> okay. Now, now we're getting okay. <laughs> okay. You ever find okay, Queen Bee's orders annoying? Yes. Okay. Yes. Yes. <laughs> yes. Do. <laughs> she keeps saying. She keeps saying, "Don't wait and uh, don't answer because it's going to uh, increase your heart rate." I think that's yeah, why. Yeah, yeah, that's, 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 I think that's why. <clears throat> yeah. I mean, you do <clears throat> talk a lot, right? Maybe, maybe she's trying to to calm down herself. <laughs> maybe. Okay. Uh, this question was from Tiger Blue's Eyes from uh-huh. USA. Is like, have you ever have a crush on a well-known fan? No, I've never had one. Okay, never have like a, no, maybe I should date this fan kind of thing. Um, you say no, and you're lying. <laughs> oh my God, this is really getting exposed today. Something's wrong with this. <laughs> you don't love Arirang Radio. You find <laughs> Queen Bee is annoying. You've been dating a fan. What else can come today? Let's see. Uh, I'm going to ruin my career today. <laughs> Okay, uh, let's see. Uh, Isaac, do Wait, you... Wait, Am- Amlita's saying <laughs> yeah. that Lex and Juan blamed the hand sanitizers here. At- maybe. Oh. Maybe. Okay, yeah. maybe. That's, that's oh, not yeah. scientifically uh, yeah. good. Okay, 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 yeah. <laughs> I'm blaming the sanitizers. <laughs> yeah, okay, whatever. Yeah. Okay, Isaac, 
Do you want to do the penalty next week also? No. Of course I don't. <laughs> okay. No, yeah, yes, I do. Hey, yes, I do. I want to do next week. I want to do next week. No, I said no. You said yes. I said yes. Yes. I want to do penalty next week. I want to do the penalty next week. <laughs> you were so close. You were so close. Okay. Karina's like, Isaac, what's happening? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. You're really getting exposed today. You shouldn't, we need the explosion effect right now. Right now. My, uh, my shoulder hurts because of this. Uh, <laughs> it like went all the way up my arm. It hurts. Uh, okay, I blame the fun. sanitizers because yeah. we've been using sanitizers all over the place. So yeah, I blame the sanitizers. Yeah, well, yeah. Okay, Whatever. okay. Good, in, <laughs> good to know that you don't know why you enjoy doing stuff. Like that. <laughs> okay, so. <laughs> Nur's like uh, Nur has been quiet the entire show and she's like I'm applying for Isak's replacement Queen B call me anytime <laughs> <laughs> Valeria's uh, saying poor Isak oh yes <laughs> Isak's okay let's do the countdown Grace because right. I'm really curious as to what's happening next week our 10, 10 9, 9 8, 8 7, 7 6 5 4, 4 3, 3 2, 2 1. 1 and the results are I think you're gonna win this week. You think so? I don't think a lot of our listeners agree with me this week. Oh, oh, oh you put your hand. Oh, 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 you there's to, no oh, hand there, here. There should, there. Okay, there should be a hand. <laughs> oh, 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 okay. I'm just gonna turn so, this down. <laughs> um, okay. It looks like that. Yeah, this. I knew this was gonna happen. Mm -hmm. Ninety-four point three percent of our listeners disagree with Couple Ah, uh, you're living the right life. That's great. That's great. Okay, <laughs> so maybe you wanna just you gonna randomly, uh huh. How about this, Chris? You choose for me. Okay. Oh, really? Mm, you choose really? for me. Okay, I'm gonna choose this one. Okay, Chris okay. chose this one for me. <clears throat> and ah, oh, oh. no use of English. <laughs> Darn it! <laughs> you wanna pick another? <laughs> Man, <laughs> I suck at that. <laughs> I can never uh, work. I'm gonna bring some interesting words. Oh my god, that's gonna yeah, be So it's fun. gonna be an extended <clears throat> way of us to learn Korean. Exactly. Yeah. All right, Chris. Thank you for ruining my entire uh, week. <laughs> Maybe my career even Maybe too. My career. Uh, and as we say goodbye, hopefully I have a job uh, next Monday. <laughs> Hopefully I have a job <laughs> uh, Sunday. Uh, but yeah, next week is going to be it's <clears throat> hard day. Yes. And so Chris and myself and also Wang Chim are going to be joining us in the studio. So right. my penalty is going to have to wait. Oh. Or it's not? Oh, Queen Bee's like, I don't know. <laughs> so we're going to find out next week. In the yeah. meantime, though, signing off, I'm going to see my listeners tomorrow. And then we've got Chris joining me next week for our live show. So we've got Jay Wack Dick inside the studio with Couple. And I will see you then. Bye.